Wells. Hello, uh, this is Chris Roberts with MTBS TV here at E3 2015, and I'm with Jason Paul, who's the general manager of gaming at NVIDIA. Welcome to the show. Thanks, Chris. Thanks for having me. Um, we're really excited about what you guys have going with Game VR. Can you tell me about what the, I think there was recent uh, announcements at Computex? Absolutely. So two weeks ago, we announced a brand new flagship GPU. It's called the GeForce GTX 980 Ti. Big performance bump over the GTX 980, 35% faster. Uh, and along with that, we rolled out some new technology that we have for uh, virtual reality, which we see as one of the big exciting trends in gaming. So uh, what GameWorks VR is, is a way for game developers and uh, headset developers to take advantage of NVIDIA technology to improve performance, reduce latency, and, and get better compatibility for headsets. Okay. Um, I did have the opportunity to see a couple of the sponsored sessions that you guys had at GDC um, when things were a little bit early, and it seemed like I was a little foggy as far as whether it was an SDK or a family of technologies or API or what exactly you know was being bundled together. Do you have any clarity or explain a little bit about what's in the GameWorks VR? Absolutely. So. Uh, we, uh, we just uh, uh, put out our first alpha SDK, uh, which developers can come to uh, our developer website and register for. Uh, but it consists of five features. Uh, um, a multi-res shading, which is a way to improve performance for virtual reality. Uh, VR SLI allows you to scale uh, performance across multiple GPUs. Uh, a feature called direct mode that allows for more plug and play compatibility of headsets. So you plug it into the system and our driver recognizes it properly and treats it like a headset rather than a desktop monitor. Uh, and then uh, two features for reducing latency, one called front buffer rendering and another called context priority. Okay. Um, a lot of the stuff um, at GDC was all about um, advanced time warping and stuff like that. Are th is that rolled into those? Yeah, so uh, context priority is a, is a capability of the GPU, allows you to switch between uh, the graphics context and the warping context to basically do a, features like a synchronous time warp. So it's a, our API for, for uh, headset manufacturers to implement uh, asynchronous time warp. Okay, um, and back to the SLI stuff. I know in the day when people were working, you know, towards stereoscopic 3D and stuff, there was you know a little bit of a trade-off in terms of doing SLI to try and get that you know one one GPU per eye and stuff. Um, nowadays, is that something that you know we can really see a, a, a good performance bump? Is it you know? Yeah, so um, so we implemented uh, uh, you know what we uh, what we call VR SLI, which allows basically one GPU to render the left eye and one GPU to render the right eye. Uh, and the way we've done it, uh, it implements so it doesn't add any latency, uh, and it gives nice performance scaling. Uh, and you can actually scale it across the, across the more than two GPUs as well if you want to go three or four GPUs to really get maximum performance. You know, VR is a super demanding application, right? So developers are hungry for as much GPU performance as they possibly can, and VR SLI gives them that. Yeah, absolutely. And it sounds like, you know, the minimum specs we're hearing about for VR systems are actually pretty high. Yeah. Um, and so the better we can get now, you know, the more optimistic it looks like yeah, that. Yeah, I mean, but. you're talking about rendering, you know, 2160 by 1200 resolution at 90, at 90 frames per second. Uh, that's uh, that's you know really demanding and taxing on today's GPUs. Right, and just looking around the show floor this year, it seems like you guys are in a tremendous number of booths and stuff. Are there any particular demos um, that you think are pretty cool? Or yeah, well, I mean, uh, if uh, if you guys have had a chance to go over to the Oculus booth and see some of the Oculus Rift demos, uh, they're they're showing some amazing stuff over there and uh, and powered by GeForce. Right. Awesome. Well, thank you very much. Um, once again, this is Chris Roberts for MTBS TV. Um, thanks for joining. Thank you.